just want you guys to say hello back to me. Remember, if you're in a place that you cannot sing, that's totally okay, but maybe you can move your mouth and show me. You can always move your hands to show me too, all right? Me first, and then my lovely is your turn. Hello, boys and girls. Yes, excellent, excellent. Thank you guys for doing that with me. Go ahead and please take out for me your rhythm sticks and go to ready position when you have them ready to go. When they are ready to go. If you do not have rhythm sticks, that is okay. You can always use your hands. Okay, if you do not have your rhythm sticks today, that's okay. You can always use your hands. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, and I know I said, um, if you have questions that you had started to ask me at the beginning, um, I will take questions towards the end because we had everyone join in. So, all right, I'm seeing a lot of people with their rhythm sticks. La 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 la. Bazinga. All right. Repeat after me, friends. Tee tee ta, tee tee ta. Tee 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 ta. Ta ta. Tee tee. Tee tee. And remember, if you don't have your rhythm sticks, you could still be going tee tee. Tee tee. You could just use your hands and clap. That works too. Okay? My turn. Tee 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 ta ta. Ta, 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 ah. Ooh, new one. Nice. We're gonna do a ta, ah, like this. We're gonna take our, our um, rhythm sticks and we're gonna strike it one time and then we're gonna scrape it up to show the second one. So it'll go ta, ah, ta, ah. Try that with me. Here we go. Ta, ah, ta, ah. It's a little bit different. If you have your hands and you're not using your rhythm sticks, it might look like this. Ta ah, ta ah, to show me that there gets two long sounds. Okay, here I go. I'm going to try um, a new pattern with some ta ahs in it. Here I go. Ti ti ta ta ah. Yeah. Ta ah. Yes. T T T T. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last one. T T ta ta ah. Nice job, everybody. All right, you're gonna go ahead and put those down for right now. <clears throat> now we are going to our rehearsal land. I'm going to ask you questions and you know that you should sing the answers back to me. Here's your first question. Do you like fall? Awesome. Do you like playing outside? Do you like pumpkins? All right, everyone, this is your last question. Are you looking forward to being in the music room next week? Awesome! I'm so excited to see you next week. Oh, I have one more. I think this one's gonna be fun. Instead of singing with words, I'm gonna sing with woofs. So I will sing with woofs, and I want you to woof back to me. Woof, 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 woof. Woof, 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 woof. woof. 
You guys are good woofers. <laughs> that was awesome. Thank you. Let's keep going. All right. Last time we were in music, we were talking a whole lot about form. And I know we've been talking about form a lot in our music class, but I was wondering, can anyone tell me what form is? Does anyone remember in music what we use form to, to learn about? What do we use form to learn about? We use form to figure out our sounds and if our sounds sound the same or if our sounds sound different. And we've been working on like the cat and mouse song and we did Star Wars last time. Do you guys remember the Star Wars one? Well, if we have time, we'll get back to the Star Wars one today, okay? But here's what I want to do. I'm going to tell you another story. And your job, actually, I need to get ready for it. <clears throat> Our story talks about a queen. <clears throat> there we go. Yes. Yes, darlings. There's my tiara. Yes. This story talks about a beautiful queen, darlings, yes, and all of her princes and princesses, you lovelies. And what happens is this queen is so wonderful, darlings. She is great, yeah, but she is very, very fancy, yes. She wants all of the princes and the princesses to walk so fancy and proper, yes. And all of the boys and girls, all they want to do is dance like crazy people. So what happens is when the queen is teaching them how to be proper and fancy, all of the princes and princesses have to act Fancy too, miss. Can you show me how you would sit so tall and fancy? Oh, yes, darlings. Oh, yes. But the moment that the princess moves and, or the moment the queen moves and turns her head, turns around, the princes and princesses dance like crazy. Can I see what it would look like if you danced like crazy right now? It could be in your spot. It could be anywhere. Oh my goodness. Look at all that crazy. I'm seeing some in their hands. I'm seeing some people up moving. So here's your job, darlings. We are going to listen to the king and queen's song. And your job is to figure out when does the queen's part happen? And when do the princes and princesses get to boogie down? Which part is which? When you think that you hear the queen, I want you to sit so proper, yes, it's so fancy. And when you think you hear the princes and princesses dancing like crazy, I want you to dance like crazy either in your seat or standing wherever you're at. Think you can do it? Yes, darlings, yes. Let's see how we do, yes. I'm going to go, let's see, I turned on my computer sound. And now, here we go, darlings. <laughs>
darlings. You have now heard, all right, you have now heard our queen and prince and princess song. Who can tell me, darlings, what came first? Raise your hand if you can tell me, did the queen come first with her fancy? Or did the princes and princesses boogie down first? Who can tell me which one came first? Queen happened first, you're so fancy. What happened second? Who can tell me? We had the queen, then we had the crazy dancing. Then what happened? Then what happened? So we have queen, crazy dancing. Queen, crazy dancing. And then there's this really tricky part at the end you might have seen me going, what do you think happened at the end? It really wasn't just the queen and it wasn't really just the crazy dancing. What do you think happened in our story? What happened was the queen turned around at the end and she saw the boys and girls dancing and she thought, you know what? I'm going to dance too. And they all danced together. So we learned our pattern was queen, crazy dancing, queen, crazy dancing, and our last part was that we all danced together. That is an awesome pattern in music. Great job for helping me figure out that form, guys. Here's what I wanna do next. Uh, last year, did we do a song? Did we do a song last year that goes like this? Listen. Apple tree or did you get to do apple tree with Mr. Woodruff last year or no? Give me thumbs up for yes, thumbs down for no. Okay, I'm going to teach you a little song real quick called Apple Tree. All right, and we will be using apple tree next week in music. All right, so repeat after me. Say apple tree, apple tree. Will your apple fall on me? Will your apple fall on me? I won't cry, I won't shout. I won't cry, I won't shout. If your apple knocks me out. If your apple knocks me out. Repeat after me, I'm gonna put more together. Apple tree, apple tree, will your apple fall on me? Apple tree, apple tree, will your apple fall on me? I won't cry, I won't shout, if your apple knocks me out. I won't cry, I won't shout, if your apple knocks me out. I'm putting together the whole shebang. Me first. Apple tree, apple tree, Will your apple fall on me? I won't cry, I won't shout, if your apple knocks me out. The whole thing, here you go. Apple tree, apple tree, will your apple fall on me? I won't cry, I won't shout, if your apple knocks me out. Whew, that was a lot. We will go back over that song next time, but I just wanted to make sure that you kind of got that in your head because we're going to be using it for a game with using Steady Beat next time. All right. So today we were able to work on ta's and tt's, and we learned our new ta a note. Today we also got to do some Ariosa land, and we continue to work on the musical element called form. We are doing so much to music, guys. I cannot wait to see you. Uh, next week. All right. Um, I saw that there were a few people with questions. I do have a few minutes to wait, but I'm going to say goodbye to everyone that does not have questions. Um, and we're going to do our goodbye. And then if you do have a question, you can wait and I will try to answer as many as I can before we have to go. Okay. So thank you guys. You guys rocked today. It was so awesome to see you and let's say goodbye. Me first and then all of my lovelies. Here we go. Goodbye, boys and girls. Your turn. You guys are awesome, Sauce. 
Have a great day, and I will talk to you all very soon. Have a great day. Bye, guys.